For a long time, scientists have tried to find the exact time during which Homo sapiens started roaming the Earth. Archaeological evidence has given us various clues, but finding an exact date is an extremely arduous task. So, we can only make guesses as to the time frame, during which the anatomically modern human first set its foot in this world. Number 1. Oldest Mummies The word mummy usually makes us think of Egyptian mummies, but humans started mummifying their dead, even before the Egyptian culture. The oldest known human mummy is from Chinchoro culture. It dates from 5000 BC, which makes it about 7000 years old. So far, 282 Chinchoro mummies have been discovered in Chile, South America. At least 29% of these mummies were formed naturally as the soil and aridity of the Atacama Desert naturally preserved the corpses creating natural mummies. The rest of the mummies had been created by the Chinchoro people, by removing the soft tissues and organs, and stuffing the body with vegetables. Number 2. Monte Verde, Chile Monte Verde in Chile was discovered in late 1975, when severe erosion exposed a strange cow bone in the area. Later, it was proved that the bone belonged to an extinct animal, which roamed the Earth about 1.6 to 12 million years ago. This discovery initiated the excavation of Monte Verde. During the excavation, two distinct levels were found, Monte Verde Level 1, and Monte Verde Level 2. Carbon dating has proved that Monte Verde Level 2, was occupied by humans from about 12,800 to 11,800 BC. A group of 20 to 30 prehistoric humans lived there in a 20-foot-long, tent-like structure. Archaeologists have discovered fossilized feces of humans at the site. Also, a footprint, probably of a child, some stone tools, and ropes and cords have been discovered. A specimen of a 13,000-year-old potato has also been found at the site. Number 3. Otzi the Iceman on September 19, 1991, two German tourists discovered a body frozen in ice in the Otztal Alps. Believing it to be the body of a deceased mountaineer, they reported it. After extraction, it was examined by archaeologist Konrad Spindler, of the University of Innsbruck. He dated it to be about 4,000 years old. Later, a more precise dating method proved that, the man lived between 3300 and 3100 BC. This 5,000-year-old mummy is Europe's oldest known natural human mummy. Number 4. Bones of Stone Age In November 2013, IT Sligo archaeology graduate, Torsten Collard was investigating some caves on the slopes of Nocnaria, in Ireland. While surveying, he found a human foot bone in one of the cave's floor. On further examination, 13 small bones and bone fragments were discovered in the almost inaccessible cave. Three bones belonged to a child, and the rest belonged to an adult. After examination, it was found that the adult died about 300 years ago, but the bones of child revealed that it died about 5,200 years ago. Number 5. A 5,000-year-old human skeleton While constructing a gallery in Garantikipa in 2017, a construction worker suddenly uncovered a human bone. Since the site was already known as a Neolithic site, Archaeologists were called and the construction work was halted. The site was already excavated back in 2010, and prehistoric shells, tools, pottery, and food were found. But at that time, no skeleton was discovered. Analysis of the skeleton found at Guarantee Kipa has revealed that the person was a female. Radiocarbon dating has revealed that the skeleton is 5,700 years old. Number 6. Eve's Footprints in 1995, three footprints were discovered on the shore of Leingbon Lagoon, South Africa by geologist David Roberts. The footprints were found on a ledge of sandstone. They were made on a steep sand dune during a turbulent rainstorm. Later, the wet footprints were filled by dry sand and crushed seashell which blew over them. The sand and seashells hardened like cement over the footprints and protected them. They were eventually buried at the depth of about 30 feet. The footprints are believed to be of a female human, and were created approximately 117,000 years ago. Number 7. The Lhasa Cave The Lhasa Cave was discovered on September 12, 1940, by a teenager, 
who entered it along with his three friends. After entering, they saw that the cave walls were covered with prehistoric paintings. The paintings are primarily of large animals, and fauna, of the Upper Paleolithic period. The interior walls and ceilings of the cave are filled with more than 600 such paintings, which were created by many generations of prehistoric humans. There is an ongoing debate regarding the time of the creation of these paintings, but it is estimated to be around 15,000 BC. Number 8. Scarabray Scarabray is one of Europe's most complete Neolithic villages, which was uncovered during a storm in 1850. The village was comprised of eight huts, which were occupied by humans about 5,000 years ago. Each hut measured 40 square meters, and contained a stone hearth, used for cooking and heating. About 50 people lived in the village. In Scarabray, archaeologists have found carved stone balls, and a number of other artifacts made of animals, birds, fishes, whale bones, and walrus ivory. Lumps of red ochre have also been found, which indicates that the people living here used body painting. Number 9. New Grange At 8 kilometers outside of Drogheda, Ireland, lies a structure built about 5,200 years ago, making it older than Stonehenge and the Egyptian pyramids. This prehistoric monument is known as New Grange. It is a large circular mound, inside which are passageways and chambers made of stone. A number of large stones of New Grange are covered in megalithic art. The original purpose of New Grange is a mystery, yet to be solved. But many archaeologists believe that it has religious significance, and may have been used a place of worship, or it may have been the place for an astronomically based faith rituals. One of the most interesting features of this structure is, its entrance which was created such that it aligns with the rising sun, during the winter solstice. The sunlight enters through an opening above the doorway, and lights up the inner chamber for 17 minutes. The precision with which the roof box is made indicates the ingenuity and precise calculation of people in that period. Number 10. Peck Merle On the hillside of Cabrerets, France exists a cave called Peck Merle, covered with paintings of Gravetten, proving that humans existed even 25,000 years ago. The cave has seven chambers filled with paintings of prehistoric fauna. There are lifelike images of spotted horses, woolly mammoths, bovids, reindeer, and single-color horses. Paintings of human and handprints also adorn these walls. Archaeologists have also found footprints of children in clay. According to experts, the cave was used as a shelter by the prehistoric people during the Ice Age. At some point in the past, the entrance of the cave got covered by sliding earth forming an airtight seal which preserved the interior thanks for watching drop a like leave a comment and don't forget to subscribe